everyone, welcome back to my book review video. I hope you all have enjoyed my past three videos, um, especially my last one, Hunting Prince Dracula. Now today, we're going to take a detour from Stalking Jack the Ripper, and I'm doing a new review on We Hunt the Flame. If you just look in my journal, that is the next one I've read after Hunting Prince Dracula. So this is book one of two. I fancy the little change and noticed this book while I was on my local Waterstones on a girly day so I thought to pick it up because I really liked the cover, I really liked people live because she killed, people died because he lived it just gave me a bit of a sense of mystery, I really wanted to read it We Hunt the Flame is a fantasy and action with a bit of romance in the story about two character worlds interlocking coming into the same adventure so we have Sephira who's like a badass huntress and the Prince of Death, Nazia an assassin prince and it's about how these two totally different characters um how their worlds collide uh, as they're hunting the same thing for totally different reasons it's a really interesting read especially with the audiobook as the two stories are being told at the same time before everything comes together so it's entering both characters worlds and we get to experience them eventually come together and how they react which i was really looking forward to in the book the audiobook is really, really good. There's two voice actors, a male and a female, one that reads for Sephira and the other females, and a male voice actor that reads for Nisia and the other male actors, which really brought the book to life for me. I really enjoyed it. Also really emphasised the humour in the book, which is great. Especially I enjoyed the male voice actor just because he was so theatrical and so enthusiastic. It was so funny. So, looking in the journal, just find it here. I actually rated this book four out of five stars. It was a really nice change. I probably would read this again. The audiobook especially really won this book over for me. And all the really descriptive scenes, the way the author writes how the scene is set is just phenomenal. I can't, I can't knock her on that. So looking in my journal, my next review is going to be on the following book, the last book. Uh, we free the stars. So I'm going to show you all my annotations in that book because I annotated it, which I specifically enjoyed and all my favourite quotes. Thank you so much again, guys, for watching. Please like, subscribe, follow, and follow my Instagram at Perks Rachel for more teasers on my next reviews. Any recommended reads you want me to do, drop a comment below as well. Thank you, guys. See you soon.